Hi everyone. Uh, so this is a schnauzer head that I'm going to be doing. His name is Fidel. Um, obviously he's not the best of breeds. He is. So um, we've already clipped his body. He is done in a seven, proper schnauzer. Uh, I've done the ears already with a 10 on the outside, 40 on the inside and trimmed around. Now I'm going to use number 10 blade. Starting from the brow bone, so I fill these two and I clip backwards. I stop at the back of the skull here, the occiput, because this is uh, the longer blade, so I don't want to make a mark. Going down on the ear, because the ear can still get caught. Try and get as tight as possible to that brow bone. Next step, I'm going to pop the ear. I'm going to go in between the ear and the eye, straight down. The width of the clipper. Then, you can find the corner of the eye, and I'm going to go from the corner of the eye towards the corner of the mouth. Making sure I don't get any of that beard. I'm going to hold the beard up. Now, sometimes they have a nice strong black hair, but he is not participating in that. And usually it's a little bit of a guideline. However, I'm just going to follow this line. I'm going to take off. There's some out here. And then again, popping this ear. Straight line. Nice and tight. Yeah. In. Now, once I've done that, I'm clearing the hair on the stop, a split eyebrow. So I'm brushing everything forward and from the side of the nose away. Say, Baba. Side of the nose away. Using my thinning scissors, I like to go down, you can go either way, and I'm trimming this. Tidy up any of the little messy hair here that the clip has missed. And the brow bone. Now I'm going to clear the corner of the eyes just like usual. Scissors on the inside, just moving my thumb, keeping my scissor completely still and not directed into the eye. Same on this eye. Downwards. Now, after I've done that, combing the eyebrows forward. And we want this part to be nice and tight. So with my scissors, I'm keeping them flat. I'm not going into the face. My scissors are pointing outwards, diagonally. And it's behind the eye. You don't want to go further forward. So it's nice and flat, like that. 
Same on this side here. So it's just this little corner here. Now, shaping the brows. Schnauzers have long split eyebrows. And take them out to the side, making sure that I'm getting all that beard in my thumb. I don't want any of that hair to get cropped. Coming from the eye, from the side where we've trimmed. And let's trim away. You can even go this way if it's more comfortable. You can clear anything that interrupts the eyesight, like this part. He has got curl in his eyebrow, but we're not going to take that off, otherwise it will be too short. Now this side here as well. Making sure I get that whole beard in. Coming from the side here with my scissors pointing towards the nose. Underneath. is a bit more straight. I just want to see the same level. Just going to make this one a little bit tighter. There we go. Now, a good thing, you always want to make sure that the eyebrows lay nice and flat on the head when they sit in. His does. If you did have a schnauzer with puffy eyebrows, then what you would do is you would just put your scissors there and just trim like that and trim like that. But his eyebrows are okay. On schnauzers, the beards are left natural. You pull them forward. You shouldn't remove any hair from here. I know sometimes owners request it, but you shouldn't. You should let it hang, otherwise it gets all fluffy a little bit like this. So we're letting that grow. And there we go. That's a schnauzer.